Hi guys, welcome to Piping Welding and GT channel. So this video is regarding uh, what is the or kinds of uh, or kinds of a uh, weld defect, okay? And why, why, uh, why uh, they have a reason why your welding or weldment is rejected, okay? Okay, so this is the first. So this is the first um, weld defect. Okay. So if you see here, they have a misalignment of the pipe. Okay. So this is the first defect, miss edge or the misalignment. So this is the misalignment. And this is the five, and this is also the five. Okay. Based on a uh, based on a codes or okay, a code uh, and a standard, they have a tolerance from this uh, alignment. Okay. In this uh, uh, inspector. There are no and the welder uh, welding inspector there are no the tolerance of this uh, five misalignment and they are referring for the uh, codes and the project specification project spec and the WPS and so on okay so next so this is a misalignment and I will draw again another another well defect so this is a incomplete penetration so here so this is the incomplete penetration or LV or lack of penetration okay this is a lack of penetration so where next so the reason why uh, the reason during fit up incorrect fit up or uh, narrow gap so this is the reason why LV or incomplete penetration okay so next drawing sorry about my drawing not good but the important here is you must know what is the well defect Okay, so this defect is lack of fruit fusion. So the lack of fruit fusion is here, and we have also here. So this is a lack of fusion. Okay. Reason the reason why I think this is a weld uh, welding speed, welding speed or the incorrect amperage or low amperage or incorrect waving so that the defect is coming from this lack of fusion okay so next defect so if you encounter this if you see like this so this is uh, undercut okay undercut so this is a uh, undercut this is also incorrect average okay so next is this is uh, underfill 
Okay, this is a swallow cup. I mean, this is a swallow cup. Okay, or a lack of lack of reinforcement. Okay, we have this is our alignment of five, and this is the well man. Okay, so this is a swallow cup. So the defect here. This is uh, underfill. So this is our uh, alignment of five, and the underfill is here. Okay. So this is a uh, under fill. So this is also a lack of reinforcement. Lack of reinforcement. Okay. So next. So this is a uh, excessive uh, reinforcement excessive reinforcement so what is excessive reinforcement here so this is our excessive reinforcement okay in the project specification or the wps or specific uh, codes they have a tolerance from the excessive uh, reinforcement okay some is standard the three times of three times of thickness Okay, so this is excessive reinforcement or excess penetration from root and from face. So next, so this defect is a concavity. Okay, so this is a concavity or a suck up. So a suck up here is from the root pass here. So this is suck up the reason why they have is uh, a excess uh, excessive amperage high amperage and they have incorrect incorrect waving okay so so that the suck up is or concavity so next the fact is if you see this one in the weld face okay this is a rough this is not good okay if you see API uh, inspector is coming this is also a rejected so this is an event profile okay a rough end this is a rough welding surface so this is not good so this is another weld defect and another well defect is so this is a overlap okay overlap so this is our uh, bevel and too much this is uh, overlap is a well face and this is our defect okay overlap so next defect is so this is a, a slug inclusion okay so a slug inclusion here they have a slug inclusion here it's also a slug and a slug so now so we have a three slug and the reason why they have a sound correct waving also incorrect webbing and during a uh, root pass and hot pass the welder not uh, what do you call that not uh, cleaning or removing the slug so this is slug inclusion okay so next defect is So if you see this one, so this is a uh, porosity, okay, porosity, because uh, during, uh, because of welding without, without um, protection.
the condition of your uh, environment during welding the too much wind windy and you have no protection okay or the welding rod is not dried and also incorrect waving or the gas incorrect uh, flow of gas so that the porosity is coming out from the weldman okay this is also a uh, rejected okay next defect so next defect is this is a uh, the tank the tungsten inclusion okay this is a tungsten inclusion so this is uh the reason is a weld this is a welding vid during jitao okay during this is a during jitao so jitao is a gas tank tanks tungsten arc welding so mixing of a tax mixing of a tungsten from the weldment so this tungsten tungsten electrode so this is also a weld defect so next defect is so this is a oxidation oxidation root So this is not good routing okay so this is oxidation root bead okay this is incorrect forging from the stainless from the forging is using only only from the stainless pipe okay so that oxidation is coming out so next effect So this is a whole oxidation, okay, on the root bead during during small, okay, in the root bead. So this is a burn through. So this is a burn through. Oxidation from the root during small. So small is. So what is small? So this is small sheet metal are welding okay next is so this is a a hollow vid okay defect caused by contam this is a contamination from the root during uh during jitao okay from the is this is from the stainless five okay this is hollow vid hollow bead okay so next defect so next defect is a crack okay so this is a not good if you see the uh, in this in the weldment they have a crack this is also a rejected okay you are not seeing from your visual eyes this crack coming out from this weldment after RT or this is a uh, NDT inspection you will see the crack and it is non-destructive examination and non-destructive test okay you will see the crack in the film okay from the this is from the NDT technician they know what is this film from the radiography testing okay this is another defect is crack okay guys so we will review it all the weld defect okay so we have a misalignment we have a misalignment we have include in a lack of penetration or incomplete penetration we have a lack root of fusion 
we have undercut so what else so we have underfill we have excessive penetration we have concavity or suck up and we have a swallow cup and we have a um, slug inclusion porosity or an even an even profile overlap so that is all a well defect okay and they have some reason from the weld defect so thanks for watching guys i hope you have uh, learned about uh, my video regarding weld defect and don't forget to subscribe and comment my video and also what is your rating in my video okay See you guys and have a nice day. Bye bye. Hi guys, welcome to Piping Welding and DD channel. So this video is regarding to welding. So we have uh, five of types of welds. So what is the types of common welds? Okay. So number one, we have a bat weld. Okay, so this is number one, but well, it's simple for that. So this is the symbol of bat welds okay so next is pilot welds so the symbol for that so here is the weldment so this is the Pilot welds. Next, spot weld or seam welds. Okay, so simple for that. We have a weld from here. So this is the weld, and this is the spot weld. Next is plug welds. A symbol for that. So this is the weld. Okay, so this is the plug or the slot welds. Next, the last is edge. Simple for that. For the edge welds, we have a welding from here, okay? So we have a pipe, types of common welds, okay? Bat weld, pilot weld, spot, plug, and edge welds. So thanks for watching, guys, and have a nice day. Bye. Hi, guys. Welcome to Piping Welding and DT Channel. So our subject is all about welding okay so this is our standard uh, standard location for the welding symbols so meaning this is uh, commonly seen our uh, isometric 
iso uh, isometric drawing we, we will see also this one in this structural drawing okay this is a uh, if you see the drawing from the support if you are fabricating a support you will see this uh, you will see these symbols okay so I will put and they have a different name or uh, from this this is a simple line but they have a different uh, what do you call that name okay so we have other side and other side okay which is our other sides this is our other side OS and this is our arrow side okay so I will uh, abbreviate it so this is arrow side and other side okay so this is our arrow line this is our arrow line and we have from starting here so this is A reference line okay and we have also a tail so this is our tail so in the tail we we will see from the tail what in a specification from the drawing so process and other reference okay and we have also and we have also this is our if you see the letter n we have a number of spot and i will put a symbols of f and a okay so a meaning is this is a finning finish symbol and we have a group finish symbol and a group a group so this is a group angle and we have this is a con so this is a contour symbols okay and we have also a weld size this is the position is from here so this is a weld size and we have also a depth so this is a depth Okay, and we have also a length of weld and also a fit, which is located from here. So this is a length of weld, and this is a pitch. Okay, this is a center from center from the welds. Okay, and we have also a weld all around, and we have a field symbols. Okay, this is this plug is a uh, our field symbols. And we have these circles is weld all around. Okay, if you see these symbols, it meaning this is weld all around. And our we have a field symbols. Okay, so this is a very very important. Okay, if you see these symbols, which is located in the drawing. Okay, if you fabricate the structural and also support you will see these symbols okay so i will uh, give an an example for that okay so i will draw the so this is our uh, specimen so if you see we have a bevel okay so this is our other side and arrow side if you see the symbol meaning this is weld you can weld all around okay and we have a 
um, see this flag this is a well built symbols okay so that's all for now guys and this is a very important symbols and bye bye have a nice day guys and don't forget to subscribe and just leave a comment if you have a comment for this just leave it and thank you guys for watching see you next time bye